Okay, so the box is assembled and in. Um, added some 2x4s around the outside of it uh, for a little extra bite room uh, once I do the seal off panels. So uh, there's going to be a port that comes into about right here um, and goes in about 6 inches. Same thing over here uh, to give me my proper port length and port area. But um, yeah, so 3 inch thick loading wall. There's the baffle. I think it came out pretty nice. Um, I noticed there were some pinholes in the Bondo that I did that I couldn't see because I was doing it in the daylight with the sun beating down on me to where I couldn't see any shadows or anything. So uh, got to fix a little bit of that. Um, but other than that, I'll need to redo this. I was using this uh, from the previous wall to sort of set um, where the box is the same as where it was before. Maybe try and salvage my old seal offs. Probably won't be able to, but um, I at least know that's a spot to where my seat can go all the way back um, now that there's you know, no subs on the front since it used to be a flat wall. So, left a pretty good amount of extra space in here. Um, it's there if I ever need it, which is nice. To not be uh, extremely pressed for a room. So, Here's the back of the box. The funny part was uh, we're actually able to build the box outside of the truck and it's uh, got a small enough form factor to slide right in through here. So even being, I think, 31 or 32 cubes after all this placement um, slid in, which is kind of funny to me. To whereas when I was building my flat walls um, in here, I had to build everything inside. So. It's definitely a different way of doing things, so um, I'll have plenty of room back here for batteries and amps. You can see that um, once the batteries go in here, amps will go above them. Um, don't want to mount them to the box because no point in mount them, mounting them to something even if there's the most minute vibration. Um, and I'll just make sort of like a stand that comes over the batteries and I'll still have, you know, 30 inches a bed length back here um, for coolers and stuff and extra tool bags and whatever for uh, going to shows so uh, I'm able to still take everything I need to take but um yeah I mean that's pretty much it so uh, stay tuned I'm gonna try and uh, be working on this thing uh, as fast as I can so